all right guys welcome back to the channel a while back the channel diecast outcast put out a call out video where he wanted anybody that wanted to participate and create a car which had to be pink or any detail in the car had to be pink and it's of course because it's october breast cancer awareness month with this challenge which he's calling it the painted pink challenge the purpose is to raise awareness and hopefully get some people to go to the doctor and get checked out now there's a few channels participating i will link everybody that i know of in the video description with that the casting that i'm going to be using for this challenge is this bw drag bus if you've been collecting hot wheels for a while you know that uh this bw drag bus was the casting to have a few years ago with this hobby, every once in a while, you get a casting that uh, everybody goes crazy about. These uh, castings are still not cheap. I bought this one on eBay as it sits right now, and it cost me close to $10. As you can see, somebody tried to do a custom with it. Got some paint chipping, but we're gonna try and do the best we can to get this looking pretty, pretty, pretty. Now these come apart pretty simple. They have a plastic part here, which is part of the windshield. They are notorious for breaking here luckily this one it's still in good condition as you can see it has a uh, a rivet which it was already uh, drilled out most likely to be uh, painted black the color it is so I'm gonna try to get that out of there without breaking anything so everything should slide down like this Like I said before, this thing is notorious for breaking over here. And just like that, the casting is ready to go into the paint stripping. Over here, there is a post, mushroom post here, holding this whole engine assembly. Uh, We're not gonna do anything with this. This is gonna go back just the way it is. So, let's get this paint off and paint it. All right, guys, and we are back. Check it out. So, it's been clean, polished, and it's ready to get painted. Now I uh, created this design, this uh, template. This is for the roof and these are for the side. Got a flame with the, with the ribbon design incorporated inside. I usually we do uh, flames recently did a video about that you paint first yellow and then maybe orange wait for it to dry sometimes you gotta wait two or three days depending on the paint that you're using then mask that off with your templates and then paint the rest of the car uh, for this custom I'm gonna go backwards so I'm gonna cover it right now 
all right and i'm gonna create a special paint from these three cream pink rose and red so it's gonna have any a, a uh, unique color from these three paints i'm gonna remove the template and the flames are gonna go a light shade of hot pink hopefully we'll turn out with a like a ghost design type of deal here with the flames and we'll see how that goes so i have these ready right now they already have uh the transfer tape so that way i could uh transfer the design over to the casting and let me see if i could do this somewhat centered it's a rainy day over here in uh, New Jersey it's crooked so let's see how it turns out well I actually bake the paint so shouldn't have a problem I've done many paint jobs while it's raining yeah I think that's good so this is vinyl it's not a uh, stencil material Mostly because stencil material doesn't like to contour to curved surfaces. And over here in the front, as you can see, it's curved. I only want the roof to be covered so I have to use a hair dryer here to shape this and then trim all the edges out so I'm gonna go do that install the sides and I'll be back all right guys check it out I cleaned all the area that I had touched with a uh, isopropyl alcohol just to make sure there's no fingerprint. And now I'm gonna use this fine tip uh, type of Sharpie. And in some areas, this doesn't do that good on, on bare metal, but I just wanna to touch it on some areas. And I'm hoping that When I paint, the paint gets a slightly different shade. Let's see here. See this fine tip that I'm do very good on. You see it doesn't matter if the vinyl gets like that what's important what's inside I feel like I should do this one inside let me see
so the purpose here is that uh, the ghost flames have areas where you can actually see the separation do some over here here it's larger so I don't want to do everything that side that side let's do this Should be good enough. All right, let me go paint, and I'll be back. Check it out. Now it's a race to get all this off before that paint completely dries. I'm gonna do that and I'll be back. Okay, here it is. Now I'm going to bake this for a little while. Basically, while, while I uh, clean my airbrush, that way we could do the other, the other color. It looks good right there though. If you want, you could uh, just hit it with the urethane clear coat but I want to do the hot pink. I'll be back. All right, guys, before I show you the finished product, let's take a look at uh, what we started with. And while I'm here and have your attention, I want to let you know that this custom right now is listed on eBay. I will leave a link on the comments, I will pin a comment and I will also leave the link in the video description. If you would like to purchase this custom, just follow the link. And here is the finished product. What do you think? I'm thinking it came out great. Super, super great. Look at the design. Look at the little lines that we made. The markings. Details front and back and special bonus I signed it inside included my web page in there I didn't put any markings on the outside so I signed it on the inside but wait yeah, if you purchase this you're not gonna get it like this let me show you how you're gonna get it all right guys here it is it's a very own custom card check it out protecto will be included take a look BW drag bus gold chrome on the Hot Wheels logo. I think I, I got used to signing every time I do a custom card. You can see it down there. And check out the back. 
You can read right there. One of one. I really liked how it turned out. Put it back. So, let me know in the comments what you think. I really like how it turned out. There it is. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next video.